what's good you guys i want to start off by doing a supporter shout out because without you guys i wouldn't be where i am today so before we get into this video i want to give a huge shout out to tony d he's always showing love and support to all content i put out and he never misses a beat so from the bottom of my heart thank you for the love it doesn't go unnoticed tony now let's get back to the video Ooh, they smell kind of good y'all hold on mmm Mmm. Oh, that joint look good at f I can't lie. Hmm. Like, no one should have to go through that. No one should have to, you know, life is just so short. I know we all have to go one day, but happy Pride Month to all members of the LGBTQ community. I wonder who gonna have the best remix. Like, I can't even count to y'all. what's good youtube it's your girl ryan jamil and you already know the deal when i say i'm back with another video all right you guys judging just based off the title of this video now you know your girl already know what you're doing here today marks episode six of try with rye I ain't gonna lie y'all these little episodes really just rolling off me like some butter if you watched my recent vlog then you saw what i was doing you know with the travel route i was trying the uh, new korean place it's called barbecue chicken y'all and it's a new korean spot here in mobile so that's what we're trying today now if you watch my most recent vlog you saw how i told y'all it's probably good but i'll never be back because it's expensive they only offer combos during lunch hours like that's so stupid if people get wings they're gonna want fries to go with them and they're gonna want a drink this ain't five guys we need i can't stand franchises that don't allow you to get combos like why i gotta get the fries and the drink separate like that makes no sense like people gonna want fries and a drink with a meal and not want to order them just during lunch hours i showed it in my last vlog but i did get fries with it, even though i had to order them separately but i got this to drink it's a cotton candy fago um i've been seeing them a lot but i haven't tried them yet and they look pretty tasty and this was like the last one left at the gas station yes i drove across the street to get my own drink i wasn't fixing to pay no darn three dollars for no fountain drink y'all this was a dollar and 25 cents so you already know what your girl about to say we about to taste test them and then we're gonna get down to business because there's some stuff on your girl heart that i need to get off you already know what your girl about to say man without further ado we about to get straight into this episode and make it do what it do let's get it all right, y'all, I got my food right here. Y'all already know what's going on. Starting off with the drink because the drink set the tone. Cotton Candy Fago. So let's see, I got the big 24 ounce, y'all. Y'all, this food smells so good. Ain't no way it ain't gonna be good. Like, ain't no way. Y'all, that drink's so good. But okay, all right, we tasting the fries first. The fries came in this. <laughs> Mmm, mmm, ooh. These fries remind me of Ward's fries. If you're from the South, especially Mississippi, then you may have a Ward's where you are, and it tastes so good. All right, y'all, now it's time for the best part. The, the, the sweet, I got the sweet sauce chicken. Packaging, spectacular, looks pretty good. But my thing is, y'all, when I asked them for ranch, they said they ain't have none. There ain't no fucking way. All you could do was get the type of sauce that the chicken was in for hot sauce. Y'all sell wings and don't have ranch? Like, I'm starting to think y'all know nothing about chicken, honestly. How the heck you even open these? It do taste like, you know, a sweet but spicy. But y'all know how if you go to like Panda Express or Mandarin Express or something like that, like in a mall or something, it tastes like they orange chicken. It ain't nasty, it just got a little tang after it. They're pretty good. If y'all ever wondering if I pray before I started eating, yes, I just don't record that part. But should I start recording my prayers? It's good. 
but I don't think it was worth as much as I paid. All right, you guys, now it's time to get down to business. I wanted to start off by remembering Miss Jackie O. A lot of you may know who she is. A lot of you may not know who she is. She was the wife of DC Young Fly and the mother of their three beautiful children. Like, no one should have to go through that. No one should have to, you know, life is just so short. I know we all have to go one day, but it says we've received official confirmation from someone close to the family. As we reported earlier, Miss Jackie O had gone for a mommy makeover with Dr. Zach in Miami and it's being speculated that she passed away from heart failure, but her official cause of death hasn't been confirmed. DC Young Fly, me, and I'm pretty sure I can speak for my audience as well. We are so sorry for the loss. I'm sending in prayer and love to you to get through this um, along the way. Rest in paradise, Miss Jackie O. You, you, you were so beautiful. I'm, I'm pretty sure you were a great role model and a great mom to your three kids. And um, I hope you rest in power. Happy Pride Month to all members of the LGBTQ community. I have friends a part of this community, you know, so I am really excited that Pride Month has arrived um, so I can celebrate with them. Um, you know, it's June 1st. It's also <laughs> my birthday month, but you know who's keeping up. Yes, you guys, I turned 25 years old this month. I have no birthday plans, but I'm so, 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 so excited for my birthday. I don't know, comment down below what I should do, y'all. I, I might I might just kick it in Mobile, you know what I'm saying? Like invite some friends over and just kick it here in Mobile. But yes, happy Pride Month. Last but not least, let's get into this God. Nikki versus Cardi stuff y'all so like I know like what Nikki and Cardi I think like last time I checked they was like beefed out or something I don't really know too much about the situation I did at the time but I kind of forgot because it was a while back Nikki done hopped on a track with Sexy Red she got a Nikki feature for Pound Town and now Cardi B hopping on put it on the flow with Lotto y'all like oh, I can't lie it's getting heated it's, 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 it's done got serious nah she done got serious. I wonder who gonna have the best remix. Like, I can't even cap to y'all. I listen to Pound Town too. It's a bop. I can't lie. It really is a bop. I can't freaking wait for a Lotto to release. Put it on the floor with Cardi is releasing tonight. But yeah, like, I'm just, I, I don't know. I love all of these women. Like, Lotto, Cardi B, Nicki Minaj. I mean, Sexy Red, she been rapping for a while, but she just not getting on the scene for real, for real, for real. You know, she brings something different to the table, but I'm ready for this Put It On The Flow remix because Lotto told y'all. I don't know, I'm just happy, y'all. Like, for some reason, I'm having a really good day even though it rained. I'm just happy I got two videos done for y'all today. I just, I don't know, do what makes y'all happy, okay? Like, do what makes you happy. Focus on what makes you happy, and I promise, like, the fruits of your labor, it'll be so worth it at the end, you guys. That concludes episode 6 of this video, Try With Rye. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Go ahead, like this video, comment down below, subscribe. Be sure to hit the notification bell on the bottom right so that you don't miss another episode on the channel. It's been lit. It's been fun. You already know the rest. If you want to keep up with your girl outside YouTube, be sure to follow my IG. I'll place it right here. Spam my likes, spam my comments, DM me, follow me. I'm always trying to get to know you guys. You already know what your girl about to say, man. Thank you guys so much for tuning into this episode. I hope to see you guys on our next one. Love you. Peace. Take me to go